The Force is with you, young Skywalker. But you are not a Jedi yet. Hey, what is up, YouTube fam? It's Dupree, aka Darth Hater, here with another reaction. This one is to my dude, Inferno, and this video is called Duel of the Dyad. So, I'm assuming this is mostly Rey and Kylo Ren based, so, uh, yeah, this one was highly recommended, so let's see what's up with this. Mm -hmm. Music is really, really good. I like this. most epic duel out of any Star Wars movie. to right by her side. Mm. Just like poetry, it rhymes. Pretty cool, man. Pretty cool. Yeah, so... Talking about Kylo Ren and Anakin Skywalker, like, um... They mirror each other, each other pretty well. More than a lot of people want to, like, really realize. You know, I feel like they both put on this pedestal that you're going to be all-powerful or... 
you know oh, the chosen one or a bloodline is like you know you come from a great bloodline so you're gonna be all powerful given these promises of like power and ability some consider it to be unnatural but you know it all at the end of the day like they're both pawns they are both pawns in this huge game all put on by emperor palpatine I, I really love the music in this the editing you guys are like you know on point with the editing like you know especially with the transitions it's getting to the point to where you know this is almost like a real lucasfilm like kind of mashup in itself like they it's almost something it seems like something they would have done I like when people do these because it helps understand like the story more like people like i said people don't want to put anakin skywalker and kylo ren in the same kind of thing because they're like, they're so different it's like no no, they're almost the same thing they're almost the same person the only real difference is one was giving one was giving better lines and a better script than the other unfortunately but you know you, you can't really f i'm not gonna really fault george for what he did with the prequels like i love what he did with the prequels that being said like we all know he's not like the best with when it comes to dialogue like that you know and original trilogy he had help and the prequels it was all him so that being said uh the sequels were you know written directed by multiple people so you had multiple you know and in, like inputs from different sources to get what we got i really really like this i kind of wish that they maybe had would have introduced the dyad thing a lot earlier in these movies or like maybe even reference them in like the clone wars or something because i feel like that just kind of came out of nowhere and it's just i don't know but something i'm a little conflicted i feel like sometimes that maybe it could have been a thing if it was like fleshed out a little bit more or it didn't need to be a thing at all i've come to terms with what we got with the rise of skywalker and that whole thing with the diet and the force and all that and it is what it is it's gonna take a lot like the movie just came out like a year and a half ago so it's gonna take a lot more time for it to fully sink in a lot more watches honestly i have not watched rise of skywalker that much since it first came out i think i've watched it maybe four times four or five times like a couple times in the theater and then a few times like you know just at home after i got the blu-ray and that's not normal that's not normal for me like i I religiously watch Star Wars back to back. Like I've watched, I can't even tell you how many times I've seen the original trilogy, the prequel trilogy. The Force Awakens is still a rewatchable movie and I watch that movie a lot. Same thing with Rogue One and Solo. I've watched those movies too many times. The Last Jedi, I, I've seen it more than a handful just to kind of come to terms with what i liked about the movie and what kind of rubbed me the wrong way i don't hate it like i'm not a star wars hater even though that's my nickname i'm not a star wars hater in the least bit yeah there's a lot of things about that movie I, I didn't really like but then there were a lot of things about that movie i really did like the same thing with rise of skywalker you know no movie is perfect i feel like obviously because star wars holds such a, a strong or high place in a lot of people's like hearts and childhoods and everything that we can be a little overly critical with things but i really like this edit and um like i said you don't really hear too much talk of the diet anymore because i feel like it was like almost like midi midi chlorians people just like scoffed at the idea and then it just went away or people don't like to talk about it but you know this is a new thing in star wars and um apparently from what palpatine says it's really rare so i'm looking for seeing what lucasfilm and the story group do with that going forward but anyway guys um this has been my review thoughts and reaction for star wars duel of the dyad put on by inferno i'm gonna leave links below for his channel down below so you guys can definitely give him a follow he has a lot of cool edits besides star wars so let me know what you guys thought about this in the comments down below anyway guys if you like this video please hit that like button and if you could be so as kind as to hit the subscribe button if you're not already subscribed and then also please hit that bell to get notifications whenever i drop my latest videos anyway thank you guys catch you guys in the next one may the force be with you bye